everybody, Gilligan Kruger, 0829 here with a quick little discussion topic video. First off, happy Halloween everyone, even if you're seeing this one or two days late. Uh, what do you guys think of my costume? I'm going for this Lawrence of Arabia-esque look. I, I think it's pretty nice myself, but Halloween's my favorite holiday, and as such, I think we should have a little discussion on horror movies. So today's discussion is your favorite, least favorite, most underrated, and most overrated horror movie of all time. And if you want to hear my picks, I'll start off by saying my absolute favorite horror movie of all time is, of course, the original A Nightmare on Elm Street. Heck, where do you think Gilligan Kruger 0829 comes from? I think everything about this movie worked, not only as a slasher movie, but a supernatural thriller. Like, I mean, who doesn't know the name Freddy Krueger now? Some kids probably know him better than Mickey Mouse. I, mean, I know that sounds absurd, but I see kitty Freddy Krueger costumes. This is a serial killer who killed people in their sleep. I'm not sure kids should know about that myself, but it's just shows how much of an influence Freddy Krueger is, and thanks to Robert England and director Wes Craven, they really made him stand out. I have to give him full credit. But not just there, what also made Nightmare on Elm Street so special was the fact that the heroine, Nancy Thompson, played superbly by Heather Langenkamp, was not your typical slasher movie girl. She didn't just run and scream. In this one, she actually fought back, and she set traps. And that reason alone, I think she's probably the strongest horror movie female. One of the strongest. She goes up there with Ripley from the Aliens movies, which also really good movies, the first two anyway. So because of that, I think it's good. We've got a great heroine, a really good villain, great direction, uh, actually a pretty good introduction with Johnny Depp, believe it or not, that was his first movie, which is ironic, because he, I personally think it's funny that he plays Edward Scissorhands when in his first movie he was killed by a character with knives for fingers, so it all comes back to it. So my favorite horror movie is Nightmare on Elm Street. My least favorite horror movie, the absolute worst I've ever seen so far, is easily Jaws the Revenge, the fourth Jaws movie. And it's really sad because the original Jaws is one of my three favorite horror movies. I think it's third after the original Alien and, of course, Nightmare on Elm Street. But this movie, Jaws the Revenge... It's horrible. It makes no sense. It's silly. Michael Caine, I don't know what the hell he was doing in this movie. I heard he turned down getting his Oscar to film this. I wonder how he feels now about that, but... Silly plot. The shark has got to be the fakest looking shark I've ever seen. I mean, you thought the shark in the first movie looked fake? At least I think they were trying in that one. This is just like... It looks like they picked it up at Toys R Us, honestly. It's just that nothing works about Jaws 4. I mean, there have been a lot of rip-offs and send-offs and parodies of Jaws, but by far the worst is Jaws 4, The Revenge. Now, for overrated and underrated movies, let's start with overrated. I think the most overrated horror movie is, believe it or not, Night of the Living Dead. I just saw it for the first time, the original about a week ago, and I wasn't impressed with it. I felt really bad, because this is a classic zombie movie, and I just came out wanting more. It didn't impress me. I know people love it, but quite frankly, I think the zombie genre just isn't for me. I kind of like my villains to be intelligent, and zombies are just... Uh, it doesn't work. I like the idea of epidemics. The zombie is a really good symbol, ballistic thing, and I love the zombies in the thriller music video, but that's pretty much it. I just, guess, I just don't like zombie movies. There we go. I said it. Trash me all you want, but I think the original Night of the Living Dead is the most overrated horror movie of all time. For underrated horror movie, I'm going to give this one to a movie called The Descent. 
You've probably never heard of it. I'm not all too surprised, but it's actually a very effective horror movie in the way it works out with cave horrors. I won't go into too much of it, but it's about a bunch of college co-eds who go spelunking, cave diving, or cave climbing, I don't remember what it was, but, and they bump into these cave vampires or something like that, and surprisingly it's actually a pretty creepy movie. It's not horrifyingly scary, but I had a lot of fun with that, so... I just wish a lot more of more. Blah, blah, blah. I wish a lot more people knew about it because it's just not getting enough credit. I don't think it's should deserves the credit that Nightmare on Elm Street, Jaws, Alien, Halloween deserve. But I think it's an okay movie. It, it's enjoyable. So there we go. Those are my picks. So here's my question to you: What's your favorite horror movie of all time? What's your least favorite, as in worst, horror movie of all time? What do you think is, are the most overrated and underrated horror movies of all time? Comment in the section below and tell me, and what do you think of my picks, personally? And that's pretty much it. Happy Halloween. Go out and scare someone. Ooh.